Think hitting delete gets rid of your unwanted email for good? Think again. Now most of us think that when we delete an email, it gets fired off into the vacuum of space, never to be seen again. But in reality, the email is sitting somewhere waiting to ultimately be overwritten, meaning that even though you can't see it, someone else probably can. Or as Rockwell puts it, Electronic Frontier Foundation staff attorney Hani Fakuri even went as far as saying, I think the most important thing for people to understand that you can't really ever delete anything. Now while those words are chilling, there are some options available to make your email difficult to access. But keep in mind, this will probably make your email harder to use, so don't be surprised if this is you after everything's all set up. Now look at the monkey. Did I get, did it capture? Why did it, it didn't say, I put it on capture. That's a pretty good monkey. Mm -hmm. You can start with the Tor browser bundle, which anonymizes your traffic by creating a false IP address. One thing to remember, though, is with Tor, that once you use it and have it all set up, you always have to use Tor. So if you screw up just once and log in with your real IP address, odds are your email provider will be able to keep linkable records of you forever. Oh, and did we mention that if you use Tor, you can't give your email provider any information about yourself? Which means you should probably set up a new email account. And since you have Tor installed, you're going to need to switch to Hushmail. Hushmail, like all email providers, will fully cooperate with authorities if you're up to something illegal, but unfortunately, it's the only email solution available offering the level of anonymity you desire with Tor up and running. Once that's set up, you can add extra security by encrypting your emails, but know that Hushmail will keep plain text versions on their own servers, because, you know, laws and stuff. And when you want to delete an email, make sure you're using special deletion software like Eraser, which will actually erase the content you want deleted when you want to delete it. Relax. You've been erased. Eraser. Just like in the movie. And remember, even if an email is actually deleted and no copy of it remains on the company server, some elements can still linger that indicate the prior presence of an email. Like when a Word doc you threw in the trash still remains in the recently opened menu, or, you know, ghosts. Get her! <laughs> so, are you thinking about switching up the way you email, or are you gonna throw caution to the wind and hope your life doesn't go all Petraeus on you? Let us know in the comments. For TFN, I'm Scott Bromley saying, stay out of my email, America.